Hey guys, it's Shirley. Welcome back to my channel. I am starting, is it spring semester? Yeah, I am a second year MBA at Columbia Business School and I'm starting my spring semester and Columbia has these things called block weeks. It's basically an elective week of really intensive courses. So, so typically a full three credit class at Columbia is a full semester long. There are also 1.5 credit classes that are maybe half term. And then there's block week, which is completely optional, but it's the week before every semester. So before fall semester, there's a block week, before spring semester, there's a block week. And I believe if you take classes over the summer, there's also a block week before the main summer term as well. And it's essentially an intensive week of class. A full term block week class is a three credit course and it's about 40 hours, five days of eight hours of class every single day, Monday through Friday. You can also take a half block week class, which is 1.5 credits and that is two days two full days two full eight hour days and then one half day for of about four hours um a lot of people do again block week is completely optional if you want to have a longer break a longer summer break or a longer winter break you definitely don't have to take block week but i think a lot of people do like them because it's kind of a quick and efficient way to get some credits out of the way and it's kind of also a great way to hack your credits at business school because because it's such a short condensed amount of time you usually have less homework than you would for a normal full semester full term class so even though it is intensive it's really full on like nine to five every single day i mean first of all that's basically just like the work schedule of a full-time job <laughs> i think that mbas definitely get spoiled by our really flexible schedule sometimes and then that way for the rest of the semester you'll probably have a much more chill schedule you might even have like full on days of no class I'm definitely a fan of block week just because I feel like it's more efficient and I'm sure that there are going to be other things that are going to come up later in the semester that I also want to put time into or that is going to take up time and attention and so I like for the rest of the semester you kind of just have a more chill schedule. So for this particular block week, I'm taking Foundations of VC. This class has, I came into Columbia thinking that I maybe wanted to do VC coming from a valuation background, really wanted to move into tech, into startups, that space and VC made a lot of sense because it's kind of a finance function within that space. Um, so I came into Columbia thinking I wanted to do VC and I'd heard about Angela Lee, who is the professor of this class before I even came to Columbia. I remember like I talked to people at Columbia and they had all mentioned her. So her reputation definitely precedes her. It's a half week block week class. So it's two full days and then one half day. I'm gonna take you with me to my block week so you can kind of see what block week is like at Columbia. like super rainy and cold today. I mean, not freezing, but it is really rainy. So it was just, just perfect for the first, for the last first day of school. It's very fitting. Welcome back to class. Last first day of class. So on the first day, the half day, Angela started with a general overview of how VC works, the diligence process, and how investors, both angels and VCs, begin to think about companies for potential investment. Why 
Angela is a VC partner and she has an angel investor syndicate called 37 Angels. So on day two, we listened to actual pitches from real founders. There were 37 Angels investment associates in the classroom and of course Angela was in the classroom. So we were actually listening to these founders pitch for actual money. Angela and the investment associates were actually evaluating the companies for potential investments. So it was really cool to be able to observe that entire process see the types of questions that were asked and really and really get a behind the scenes glimpse into how VCs consider and evaluate different founders and the companies that they're pitching. And then we as students were able to talk to the founders and begin to ask diligence questions. We had to form student groups and actually write diligence and investment memos that Angela would then take into consideration when reviewing these startups for investments. So this was the beginning of that process. Okay, we just met with our groups and did um, our group project, which is a diligence memo. Now we have about an hour break, so I'm going to go get lunch with a friend. We're going to walk and try out this new cafe that just opened apparently on this campus, Manhattanville campus, so I'm going to walk and get food. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, sometimes you win, sometimes you win. It's already too late, we've already done all the court classes. Do you mind if I'm with this? Hey, are you sure? Yeah, okay. Thank you. 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 Is that your iPad? Is that your iPad? I swear. Oh wait, oh shit. This is your iPad. I, I was, was like, like, I was thinking, why does mine have 60% I was like, <laughs> yeah, I was like, where's mine? <laughs> yeah, no, that's... Wait, where? Oh, oh god, oh my god, mine is in my bag. I just like took her. That's really funny. <laughs> 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 you got 10 seconds. Too much. Too much to do. Uh, I'm, I'm <laughs> oh shit. And then on the last day, I didn't record as much footage because it was honestly just very much of the same, all just in the same classroom. It was nothing that you hadn't already seen before. The last day was dedicated to learning about venture math. We learned about different ways to value startups, learned about priced equity rounds, convertible notes, really learned the ins and outs of venture math. I'm curious what you think about VC as an industry. Do you find it interesting? Is it something that you're contemplating? And also curious what you think about the block week format. Let me know in the comments and I'll see you again soon.